Hello guys, welcome to the year 9 session of the Entity Framework Code 2.0 tutorials. In this session, we will see how to delete the entity from the uh, database by using the Entity Framework Core. Let's switch to the uh, Visual Studio. Create a new action within the uh, our controller, which will return the uh, string of name delete book which will take the uh, integer book id as a parameter create a try catch block if the exception occur then we need to return the x dot message in a try block we need to check whether we receive the uh, book or not or that we need to write the uh, book id equal equals zero and then return enter book id message oops id and n will be a small else First of all, we need to check that the uh, book with the uh, given ID is uh, present in the uh, database or not. For that, we need to retrieve it. Write the uh, where result equal to context dot book dot single or default async. And write the uh, lambda expression that is uh, b such that b dot id equal equal book id and obtain the uh, book from the uh, result where book equal to result dot result and now check where the book equal equal null. Then we need to return book with the uh, given ID does not exist. Else we need to use the uh, context dot book dot remove method within that we need to pass the uh, entity that is uh, book and call the uh, save changes method and return book deleted successfully Save the uh, file and run the uh, project. Now open the uh, action to retrieve the uh, book details of the uh, book ID 3. You can see that uh, there is uh, details for the uh, book ID 3 is uh, present. Now copy and Call the uh, delete book method, and you can see that book deleted successfully message. And now again refresh this book details method. You can see that not found the book with the uh, given ID. Means that the uh, we are already deleted the uh, book from the uh, database. And now again refresh this page. You can see that the book with the given ID does not exist because we have already deleted this book. Let's see what we are learning in this session. To delete the entity from the context, first of all we need to retrieve the entity from the database and then we need to call the remove method of the adb set to which will take the entity as a parameter and pass the entity that you want to delete 
If you have any doubt, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.